Uh, hey everyone, it's Troy Jackson. Uh, great, great news. Uh, both House and Senate's enacted uh, the child care bill. We've been talking about LD 1726, the bill that uh, I've been working with right from the start coalition all along, right from the beginning of this session. You know, this is a bill that uh, doubles the child care stipend going to uh, the workers. It actually raises the uh, subsidy rate from 85% of uh, medium wage to uh, 125, and then it actually pays, uh, you know, child care providers based on enrollment, not attendance, and you know, helps with the Head Start program. I mean, there's a whole bunch of really great things in this bill, and what's really great about it is probably one of the bills that probably the, the bill that I worked on the most that uh, you know brought people from all around the state, uh, different uh, political ideologies. Like I said, worked with the Maine State Chamber of Commerce, worked with uh, Maine AFL, worked with like everyone across the state uh, in a way, bipartisan way to get this uh, passed. Now we got to get it uh, funded in the budget, the supplemental budget, which you know, I'm feeling very, uh, very positive about because again, they're just such great energy as far as doing this, and it's important, you know, I mean, people need to know that they have child care that's affordable and quality. Uh, this is what we're talking about. Those child care providers need to know that they can afford to keep the lights on. And, uh, you know, parents need to be able to, like I said, have, have help uh, getting that because if, if child care is going to be quality, if you're going to have people making a decent wage, it's going to cost money to, to do that. I and mean, parents need to know that they're going to be able to afford it. So this is something that, again, I'm super excited uh, that we got uh, enacted in both the House and Senate and now on to get it funded and get it signed by the governor.